Hi guys, welcome to professional communication tips from the KISS Academy and of course KISS stands for keep it short, simple and specific to be a more effective and efficient communicator. When I hear people disagree with each other, they often start their response to the other person with phrases such as no but or no because and the words no but and because are very dangerous words to use when beginning your response because they actually break rapport with the person you're communicating with. And breaking rapport is one of the first steps to actually creating conflict between you and the person you're negotiating with. And we know that when we create conflict, we're not going to get what we want. I've been using a phrase for a long time now that you can use to disagree with someone without actually saying no and without creating conflict. Do you want to know what it is? It's this. I appreciate that. Now, when you say, I appreciate what you're saying, you're not saying I understand, so you don't have to understand. And you're not saying I agree, which means you don't have to agree with the person. You're simply acknowledging the other person's point of view. And by using the word appreciate, again, you don't have to understand, you don't have to agree, you're just acknowledging. And when you follow that phrase with something like, what about this? Or how about we consider some other ideas? Or have you considered option B? So try this next time. I appreciate what you're saying. How about we consider some additional options? Or I appreciate that. What about if we look at this from a different point of view and then continue your negotiation? I'm sure you will see that rapport will continue and conflict will be minimized or even eliminated. I hope this tip was useful to you and until next time, make sure to keep it short simple and specific in your business and professional communication to make it more effective and more results driven.